My Digital Landscape. Hey, this is William with My Digital Landscape, and this is Squarespace Talk. Uh, today we're going to go over how to change your footer. And this seems like the most simple thing, um, and Squarespace has done a great job of making this uh, a lot more simple than it was at one point in time. But still, we get a lot of people that are confused. Um, a lot of times you'll have the Powered by Squarespace in your footer, depending on the template. And uh, this is something that it, it seems weird be, to be able to get to where you want to edit it sometimes, and people have a hard time doing it. There's also sometimes the uh, Powered by Squarespace badge that you'll want to turn on or off that's in your footer, or the other footer content. But the footer is something you're going to be able to edit just like you would edit any other page. And the trick is, is all you have to do now in Squarespace 7 is have your... Um, have your toolbar open on the left hand side. Once we open this toolbar, just like we get these pop-ups to edit the pages, you're going to get the same pop-up when you're hovering over the footer. So we have footer content and we have the ability to edit the footer content right here. From right here we're going to be able to come in, add other things to the footer, text, images, um, be careful with images. You're going to want to make sure that they're resized to be pretty small so that they fit in the footer um, the right way, especially for mobile. But you're able to really add anything that you could add on a standard page into the footer and move those content blocks around just like you would on a page. So again, we're just clicking right in. This will need to be open so that you're viewing this bar and then hover right over until you see the edit box pop up click edit and you'll be able to edit what is in your footer. If you are showing the Squarespace badge and you don't want to be showing um, the badge, you can go right over here into um, your design settings and this is going to be under Squarespace badge and you can change where it's positioned um, or turn it off for most websites or if you want to show off how wonderful Squarespace is Feel free to move that one around and um, leave that one where it is. This has been Squarespace Talk on changing or setting up your footer with Squarespace 7. I am William. Have a great day. Cheers. My Digital Landscape.